Distance learners, you can blame your classmates. Because Mr. Hale has an excuse, he's too old, he forgets stuff. But these people are young, they're supposed to remember. Hey, classmates, it was actually uh, Tommy. It was Braden. So we just went over the questions on page 624. Now we're going over the questions on page 629. Leah. And then what kind of thing, what kind of problems does that create? Uh, population? Oh, yeah, population. What kind of problems does it create, Harding? Sorry, no, it's just overpopulation. Overpopulation means what? Not too many people. Not too many people. Let's keep this down, okay? There's not, enough resources. not enough resources to meet their needs. India has enough resources to meet their needs when what happens? The drift. Uh, high, or what's the wind thing? It's just monsoon. Monsoon. When the monsoons happen when they're supposed to. Okay? When the monsoons don't happen when they're supposed to, that's when starvation happens. But they still have enough resources to meet their needs. Only in those cases. But population does create other problems. Large city creates other problems. What are the problems? We've gone over this last year when we talked about our country becoming urbanized. Um, you get too much population density and um, you get... Um, well, what, what does too much mean? There isn't enough room for everybody. There is, though. It costs too much to live there. The cost of living can go up. That's one, yeah. Everyone has cars and it's creating a lot of pollution. Pollution, pollution is another one. What else? Um, low standard of living. Sometimes in India for sure, okay? India more so than our urbanization. Okay, in our country, we have a big middle class. In India, you're what? You are either you're very rich or very phone. poor. You're it's not a very, well, at all middle a, class. This is a middle with the phone scammer. The homes in the cities I know. in I India. Know. That's why, if you've, you've ever seen the movie Slumdog Millionaire, anybody seen that? No, but give me a credit card. One Academy do, Award, do, Slumdog do, do, Millionaire. Do, 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 do it. It's about India and some of these slums that are in the cities. No, but we have phones. You must your credit card. Okay. <laughs> we need your credit card info. No. Send it now. <laughs> other question. The other you can see on the page 628, that picture shows you another problem. Traffic. Traffic's a big problem. Mr. Hell, I have a question. I think I can answer on this page. No, Lucas, no. number uh, one seat is because then they don't have to live in the overcrowded cities and stuff. So, yeah. They don't have enough money. So that's one reason cities are crowded. What's the other reasons for living in villages? Uh, have another one. Trail meat and shit. So then they can like make their own food and not have to share it with everyone and stuff. So they have to share. Yeah. Okay. So there is farming areas there for that. And the others just because of tradition and their history. Let's hear from somebody we haven't heard of for an answer on one of these questions so we don't have to write them out. Ew, it's Tommy. 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 Uh, for uh, one A, uh, it's um, Islam, Buddhism, uh, Sikhism, and Jainism. That's cool, but who asked? And you missed the number one. Who asked? Oh, into it. Okay. Tommy, who asked? Mr. Hale asked. Not Tom. Leah? You go in here. Lucas. This is your warning. Fine. Um, for 2B, um, it gave the farm, it let the farmers have a lot more better tools so they could produce a lot more and it would, and they could be more prepared for if the monsoons came at the wrong time. 
still making our food. So what does Green Revolution mean? Um, it encouraged farmers to get more better methods. Better farming methods, use of more machinery, use of better crops. That means you produce what? More food. A lot more. Aryan. Um, They're predicting India will be number one in no population one. very shortly, probably within the next five years. Why? Just because not having more kids. Because their growth hasn't changed. China, we're going to study next, which is the largest. China's government at one time had what policy? The one one child. Child. You can only have one child. It's no longer a policy in China, but because of that, that regulation, in China, their population growth slowed up, but India has kept. Okay, so that's why they predict India will overtake as the number most popular. You can see at the map there on the left population. Each of those dots represents what? 100,000 people. Okay. So you can see around the Ganges River how densely populated that area is. Why? Because it's good soil. The Ganges that's the soil like <coughs> that's there, and most of them are farmers. Okay? And they're also moving into the, some of the cities that are there. Did we get them all answered? So the last section of the chapter is dealing with their neighbors that you have to know for the t test, or at least the map part of the test, which is, you know, Bangladesh, Bhutan, Nepal, and uh, Pakistan. Okay, so you'll read that and do the review. We're going to watch a couple short videos on India, top ten, in amazing facts, and then our, our uh, Barbie one. On India. Geography now. Geography now. Okay. So, I think I put that on the assignment at home. You can look at those videos and do the review for next time. Don't forget to be studying the maps. There is a map test on, map part on the test in place of a what?